Okay, so let's create a super split test, the Course Envy super split test. So for this objective, I'll choose traffic. We're gonna name it, I already have the naming convention here. So it's the traffic type, traffic, top of funnel, super split test, and then the date. So we're good there, just delete any spaces. We're gonna make sure CBO is on, campaign budget optimization. I'm gonna do at least we'll see maybe 20 or 30 split tests so I want at least a dollar per so that's fine continue on to the ad set level so this will be our broad campaign we're gonna just make it very broad and then each ad set we can change from there broad we'll do USA only for this one so we'll leave this empty for now no detailed targeting, those will be in the split test, automatic. And then obviously we wanna turn on dynamic creative. I wanna test multiple images. So scroll down, auto, great. Continue on to the ad level. So select our identity, our page, and our Course Envy Instagram account. So our images, we can choose up to 10. So we have the URL. Add the URL there. Now we want to build some parameters. We have our UTM source. UTM source, there's that pasted in. And then our coupon code. Okay, we'll apply that. There we go, I wanna just test this, make sure it works. Toss in a new tab. Okay, there we go, 10 proven, great. Now back to our ads manager. We have our primary text ready here. Add that in. We're not gonna do any dynamic testing here, no dynamic creatives. We're gonna just start with these, because they're pretty proven to work for us. Okay, great, learn more. So now we wanna add our media, our images. We can add up to 10, so add image, and we'll upload a new image. There's our three split tests. Okay, our three split test images have uploaded, continue. Okay, it looks good, scroll down and publish this ad. Confirm. Now our super split test ad is publishing. So now select that check mark next to the campaign name, go to the ad set level. Now we're on the ad set level. Here's our broad ad set, our first split test. But again, we wanna duplicate this and create, let's just go for it. Let's go for a full 29. So that'll be 30 collective ad sets. So duplicate and in the original campaign. So now your edit menu will expand and here's all our copies. So we're gonna leave the ad as is. Remember, we're only testing one variable at a time at the ad set level. So now I'll come in and I'll adjust each one of these ad sets. So this main one, broad, that's fine. We'll leave it as is. This next one, I'm gonna do one of my favorites, engaged shopper. Okay, so now we find that in interest. behaviors there we go so there's our first one now we need to come in and edit each one of these each ad set we're going to keep changing to a specific detailed targeting we want to test custom audiences we want to test so right here we can test custom audiences or look like audiences look like audiences are great top of funnel so look alike so let's do a one percent 
of our buyers USA there's a great one and then I'll just copy that name and I'll throw that for the ad set perfect now let's just keep continuing on scroll down our next one to adjust let's do another look-alike for the five percent and so on buyers five percent USA change that to five percent okay so as you can see this is a little timely so I'll just time-lapse here and publish this and then we'll come back and look at some results in a few days after a thousand impressions to see which ads are performing and then we'll toggle off the losing ad sets and scale up the budget on the winners and take some of those variables onto new ad sets okay so it's been 24 hours so we can check on our super split test so just select this one go to the ad sets and as you can see we're not quite to a thousand impressions on all of these ad sets yet but we can start to see a few emerging as winners. College, there's a specific one that jumps out, 25 link clicks, 38 cents per click. We've already hit our testing threshold of 1,000 impressions. Scroll down here. This Entrepreneur Magazine, gonna let that run a little longer. That's doing really well at a cheap cost per click. We can actually sort this uh, cost per result. So scroll up here, click that again. There we go. So, three cents, two clicks, owner and founder. We can click the results column to see by actual link clicks. So, Broad USA. Typically, the Broad does do pretty well just because Facebook is trying to identify people within that Broad market that will interact with your ad. So, we'll leave that one going. Marketing, I thought that would do well. College, obviously, I said. Engage shoppers, like I said, this is always one of my best performing behavior targeting. One of our lookalikes is doing well. This is a lookalike of engaged with our Facebook page in 180 days. So nothing too overly expensive per click here, 44 cents. We could keep those going. This three cents, want to give it some more time. So like I said, typically wait up to three days or until all these impressions or a good majority of them are over 1000 impressions but we could cut some of these today we can scroll down here looks like a udemy that one's only got 100 impressions only 23 cent ad spend this buyer look like again pretty small but no link clicks yet so these are some that i could be toggling off so we can focus the ad spend on these winners the ones that are already getting results and link clicks then as for dynamic creative again go to the ads so now let's look at the breakdown, dynamic, creative, image. Remember, I split test the images. So here we go. We can see our results. Click off of this, and we'll sort by results. So there we go. Each ad set at the ad level is broken down by images. So for our first one, this is the Broad USA, as you can see the ad set name, 24 for the Lambo picture, 6 for the pink, 2 for the orange. So orange is a clear loser in this one. Let's see if that's a recurring theme here. Yep, Lambo 23, 3 for pink. Wow, so a real winner there. For the college ad set, again, Lambo 19 clicks compared to pink 3 none for the orange wow so look at what we identified here the green lamborghini is the one that's getting clicks so now i can take this asset into my own separate ad with the few clear winners here from our ad targeting and then further optimize so it's all about optimizing our ad set and ad to create that evergreen ad that we can scale up and put a lot of money behind Thanks for checking out Course Envy. Please take one second to like, subscribe, and comment anything below. These three things are the key to getting your videos to rank higher in YouTube search results.